The Central Bank of Nigeria says due to the expected increase in crude oil production arising from improved surveillance and infrastructure, better maintenance of plants and increased investment in the oil sector, growth would be enhanced in the industry sector. Also, gradual revival of domestic manufacturing due to a more stable exchange rate, higher anticipated demand for from a growing middle class, improved microeconomic conditions, as well as access to cheaper foreign inputs are expected to spur domestic manufacturing and industrial development. Deputy Governor Economic Policy Directorate of the CBN, Mahmoud Datijo, said this at the 10th National Economic Outlook, Implications for Businesses in Nigeria in 2024, organized by the Chartered Institute of Bankers of Nigeria. Justin Akadonye tells us more. 2023 has come and gone, and Nigeria is now faced with the current realities and anticipation for a better future. As the country traversed the uncharted waters of 2024, it is imperative to critically assess the challenges and opportunities that lie ahead within the ambit of the constraints imposed by global and domestic conditions. Setting the ball rolling in his opening remark, Chairman of Council of the Chartered Institute of Bankers of Nigeria, CIBN, Ken Okbala, notes that foreign exchange fluctuations depreciated the Naira by 49% over the past year, impacting import costs for businesses. Okbala advises that Nigerian banks must proactively prepare for capitalization to service the desired $1 trillion economy by 2026 amid economic uncertainties. The banking industry is very strong and resilient. And I think that the public needs to have that confidence we can assure you that the industry is very strong, is resilient, and also even with the new phase of capitalization, I can assure you that the industry is very strong enough to you know, meet up the requirement. The global economy continues to face the challenges of inflation and low growth prospect. Experts say GDP growth remains stronger than expected in 2023, but is forecast to moderate further in 2024 on the back of tighter financial conditions, weak trade growth and low business and consumer confidence. How to look that experts are predicting with regards to a fall in inflation Deputy Governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria, who is represented by the Director of Monetary Policy Department, Mohamed Tumala, says while the potential for growth exists this year, each sector may encounter unique challenges and opportunities. Other experts also give their overview of the key sectors of the economy and the 2024 outlook. The anticipated moderation in pump prices of the PMS due to the expected operational status of the country's key government and privately owned refineries in 2024 is a pivotal factor in the economic equation. 4.1% of the grain we consume in the world was coming from Ukraine. And then we thought, okay, now we understand that. Maybe we should begin to look at some other avenues. The response to the pandemic resulted in macroeconomic instability, which, of course, as mentioned earlier by a key speaker, created inflationary pressures all over the world. The services sector is expected to continue its dominance on the growth trajectory this year, driven by mobile money adoption, increased government partnerships, and expanded digital lending offerings. Justin Akadoni, Plus TV News, Lagos. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.